morning. So, we are 95, 96 miles in, 5 o'clock in the morning, or between 5 and 6 in the morning. Um, first leg of the day over halfway through, um, so another 8k, 5 miles to go on this. Um, then we have another one, then we have a 12k, 7.5 miler, and then we have, if my maths are right, <laughs> I think I need to get them checked, um, a 10k to finish. Um, yep, <laughs> so tired now, um, although interestingly enough, um, before I had a sort of two hour kip last night, um, the, uh, the last leg before that, um, it was one of those where sort of limbs have stopped functioning kind of thing. Um, a real, real effort to stay upright, <laughs> um, going down the roads to home. Um, so <laughs> it wasn't helpful, um, but hey, just keep moving. Um, so slight update on, um, you know, who am I kind of question and all that kind of thing. So, uh, so <laughs> funnily enough, um, Helen saw me, uh, just as I got in yesterday and said, what, what did happen yesterday? So I think I might've got away with it in so far that she was out of it herself when I came up and asked her, who am I? Um, and what do I do? Um, but something similar happened this morning. Um, a bit of a theme here. I think it's all connected. So it's connected to a number of things. So firstly, it is slightly disconcerting um, to wake up on the floor um, in your own house. Um, particularly if you haven't had a drink, because um, that's just really stupid. Um, knowing you're in a race or a challenge, but actually um, you're not in so far that there isn't the usual paraphernalia, etc., that goes with that. So, you know, so there's no, there's no checkpoint staff or race director or whatever standing over you. So it's, and if you, if for a couple of minutes, and it does seem to take a couple of minutes to sort of get the, uh, the sort of, the, the mists of fog or whatever it is to clear. Um, I, both days now I found myself going, what, what, who, what? Um, and it has been a real issue around sort of like, you know, where do I go? Well, one of my problems with this is that sort of, you know, it's random route selection every day, so, or every leg even. Um, so there isn't a plan. So it's not like I've gone to bed the night before or gone for some kip the night before and gone, um, what we're gonna do is this. Um, I've almost written it on a board or something like that. That might be helpful for the future, but um, I haven't done that. So uh, so it takes a little while for my head to get round. It's, uh, you know, all of that kind of stuff. Um, but it sort of explains why I said what I said. Anyway, good news is that she just thinks I was being daft again. So there you go. Um, but somehow connected to all of this, which maybe is a whole different story and I haven't worked this one out yet at all. But apparently I'm, um, I am the physical embodiment of Thor. Not because that's what anybody's told me, but that's just how I've been feeling when I've woken up. Um, just adding to my confusion. Um, but anyway, um, after that, I don't know if I'm gonna bother with anything else later today. Um, you probably tell um, the, the hood's up not to necessarily stay warm. It's, uh, it's, well, it's light rain, it's not anything too dramatic. Um, but uh, we are promised rain all day, so uh, depending on how that goes, um, is whether or not you see me again. If not, uh, hopefully I finish. <laughs> yes, bye-bye. <laughs>